Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. In today's video guys, uh, we're going to show you how to remove and replace the windshield wiper trim cowpiece. Okay, this one right here underneath. So let's open the hood and just show you a little bit better because I cannot show you now. Okay, this piece right here, that whole trim piece, we'll show you how to remove it. Some people remove it to work on the turbo, some remove it for windshield uh, wiper motor, uh, for putting a new windshield, all different repairs like that so uh, we have guys more than 200 videos taking this car apart please guys subscribe give a thumb up for all the work we do also i would really appreciate if you check out our new channel electrical car repair life quite a few videos coming there uh, on fiesta as well for diagnosing engine codes airbag codes things like that so let's start on it now so first after you open the hood okay you need to remove those seals on the windshield wiper arms uh, those are the one that protect the nuts here okay those nuts usually are with 15 millimeter we'll check in our case if it's 15 13 so let's see okay 15 perfect now how you remove those those tend to get stuck and you need to install them exactly in the same position you took them off later otherwise your wipers will be off they will not be aligned okay you need to grab it okay and you start moving it a little bit okay and it's stuck okay pretty good but when, once you move it left right up and down okay eventually it will come off so this one here it will be the same procedure as well okay so let's see okay this one is hitting the windshield a little bit so I'm going to go ahead and open the hood a little bit more or close it okay with closed hood I don't know if we'll be able to get it yep careful not to scratch your paint okay perfect this one came out as well next with a flat screwdriver okay we're going to gently pull those clips out Okay, just like that. So you can see quite a few clips. Careful not to drop them because those are easy to lose. Okay, so far we have two. After that, that's the third one. Fourth there. Five. So you can see all of them are I'm <laughs> just doing the same thing and sixth one So let's see what else we need to do after we remove this one Okay, right here we need to pop the seal open hey, Okay, you can see It came out careful because those are easy to break. We almost got this one loose on this side Okay, so let's go ahead and pull this one out as well Okay, what you need to do, just grab it with your fingers, okay, like that, and pull it out. After that, you grab it and you need to pull it towards the front and up at the same time. Okay, just like that. Okay, check it out now. We have to remove the bottom piece for the windshield trim right here. And in order to do that now, we have to go ahead and remove the headlights. So. We have to, uh, they're pretty easy to remove. Thir T30, this is top sturdy. We're going to remove that bolt here. One bo bolt over there. Okay, the same thing on the other side. We'll do both of them simultaneously. So we don't have to switch the tools. Okay, perfect. Now we need to <coughs> go ahead and get the uh, panel removal tools and we'll need to or, uh, or fuel up screwdriver, okay, and remove these two clips. You can see one right here and one on this one. So we can actually go ahead and remove the headlights out of the way so we can remove that piece. Okay, this one you have to unscrew the middle part. 
and once you unscrew it okay you can remove the clip all the tools guys that we use will be listed in the description of the video below so please check them out now the same procedure on this clip right here we need to undo the unscrew the middle part sometimes they will not unscrew so you have to help them they will be sleeping okay perfect now we can go ahead and pull the headlights out of the way uh, usually you pick them on the back side you have to be careful not to scratch your bumper okay like that and we can go ahead and disconnect them actually so we don't scratch anything okay just like that and let's do this one here as well Okay, just push on the clip and pull it out. There is a special place that you push on it. Now, why we remove them? Because there is a hidden bolt right here on each side that we need to remove with a 10 millimeter socket again. Okay, and with the same one, okay, we'll get extension. There is one more bolt right there. So let's get this one done as well on this side. Two more on this side. Okay, now that piece will need to slide forward. Okay, on this side it got loose. Okay, so let's do this one now. Okay, now we need to disconnect. Okay, uh, let me just disconnect this line here. Okay, we can just pull that thing out or we can disconnect it from here. Okay, like that. Now, you can just pull it straight out of there. Okay, just like that. So that's how you guys remove both of them. You can see if you need to work on anything. You can see how much uh, room we have now. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and see you guys next time.